Hello guys and welcome back. In this lesson, I will teach you the save word options. So basically, what does save word option mean? So there is a feature in Word 2016 that allows you to set the timer for auto saving and so on. And I will teach you more in this lesson. So without any further ado, let's move with our word options. So you need to navigate to file first of all. So simply click file. And you've got a couple of options over here or tabs you can say. Which the first one is info. Then new. This opens up a new document. This opens up a new document from your file explorer. And save, save as, print the document, share the document, export the document close word account feedback and options so we are going to be working with the options tab for now so let's click options and this opens up a word options dialog box in front of you so in this dialog box we will be working with the save function for now and once I click the save function over here the first option is save files in this format so once you're writing an article or anything or a word document and you press ctrl s it will be automatically saved on your computer with this file extension which is the standard file extension for a word document you can change the extension in which you want to save your document by default from over here you can choose it to be dot x dot m simply dot and so on the other option the night or the next option is save auto recover information every 10 minutes you can lower this and you can also increase this time but the but the default saving timer for word is 10 minutes and basically this means that whenever you're writing something or writing a word document it will automatically save your document every 10 minutes so your information keeps safe the next thing is auto recover file location which is important and this means that when in the uh, when your word document unexpectedly closes which we learned in the previous lesson the auto recover function lesson that when your file or word 2016 unexpectedly closes your auto recover file or unsaved file will be stored in this particular path this specified path and we have also been to app data roaming microsoft in one of our previous lessons which was modifying existing templates so we're familiar with this the next thing is default local file location so this means that once you press ctrl s save your document it will open up your documents in your file explorer and you can save it over here you can change the path by simply clicking browse and choosing wherever you want to save, whether it's desktop or any other folder inside your file explorer the next important thing is saved checked out files to the first option is the server draft location on this computer and the second option is the office document cache the first option means that if you're using or editing your article or word document and somebody else tries to open it with your account or your colleague tries to open it with your account and edit it will only open it a read only mode and will tell that person that one once you finish editing your document then only he or she can open up your document and edit that document so this is a very handy option to use while editing word documents so this was the important thing in this save word option feature and I hope you learned a lot from this particular lecture so stay tuned, stay focused and let's move to our next lesson.